Hola chicas, I'm Adrian Adams and this is Adri's Yummy Hour. And in this corner, the queen of acronyms, the social media champion, Brian Benwell. F to Brian. Oh, hey everyone. Sorry, I was just telling all my followers to look out for a video, which I know will be hashtag Amazeblogs. Putting my phone away now. Our key ingredient of the day is agar agar. So nice, they named it twice. It's a jelly agent that is made out of algae. With our key ingredient, we can make... Does this mean that we get to play with our food today? Because my parents always said to never play with my food, which I never totally understood because, hello, have you ever seen a pizza be made? BTW, what's the deal with burgers and why aren't they just called beet sandwiches? Brighton, calmate. With our key ingredient, we're going to make some fantastic and super yummy honey beets. And don't worry, agar agar is super safe to eat. Would I ever steer you wrong, chicas? Well, there was that one time that we... Are you ready to cook, Brandon? Ready. Vámonos, let's get this culinary party started. Primero, we're going to pour half a cup of honey and one third cup of water into a saucepan. Next, we add two grams or half a teaspoon of agar agar. Now, let's mix it all up and bring it to a nice boil. Remember to always get a parent's permission before cooking and always have a parent nearby when handling hot food. Correcto, chica. You're pretty smart. You know what they say. Smart is the new cool. Take a pie pad and fill it with the hot mixture. Then, take a big glass of cold olive oil and begin putting teeny drops of honey in. Make sure the olive oil is cold. It's the cool temperature that helps the proteins in the agar agar to bond together or coagulate. How cold are we talking here? Like cute scarf cold or like my family's forcing me to move to Iceland cold. Just plain refrigerator cold. Oh, that's doable to me. <laughs> they should all float down to the bottom of the glass. Once you think you have enough, scoop them up with a spoon and dump them into a bowl of water to chill. Stir the water around so the beads separate. Whoa! It looks like they're doing a beautiful water ballet. I wonder what we would look like doing water ballet. And finally, we scoop them up and put them on a plate. Dale! Honey beets! Pretty brilliant! <laughs> In España, we often eat honey with cheese. But you can put the honey beets on your toast or even your tea. Salud! Mmm, hashtag yummy science, this is fantastic. I could totally make a cute necklace out of these and munch on it throughout the day when I get hungry. What can I say? I have the culinary chemist touch. That's all for Adri's Yummy Hour. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to click the button below to subscribe. Adios amigos. <laughs>